Let's try and get a boon. Let's try and get two boons. I didn't necessarily expect to make it this far on this play. Okay. Do it. A rare opportunity arose. The great boons of Leshy's woods were on offer. The trial of the wink, the three drawn cars must include a car with the airborne sigil. The trial of the fend. The trial of rarity. The three drawn cards must include a rare card. I know I have like four, three or four flying with that, like none of these. I don't know what's considered a rare card. Try this. That's my best chance. Yes! Ah, Raven is a card with the airborne sigil. Success. Your choice of boons. The boon of the ambidextrous, draw twice at the beginning of my turn. Boon of magpie's eye. When you draw from your deck, you may choose any card in your deck to draw. Boon of the forest. You will start a battle with grand furs on all of your spaces. <sighs> um. Let's try magpie's eye. Once again. The trial of the swift. The three drawn cards will include a card with the sprinter sigil. Trial of the ring. If you have a ring, you pass automatically. The trial of skins. The three drawn cards include a pelt card. Ah, crap. Um, I wasn't paying attention if I have a ring. I don't think I have a ring. I don't remember seeing one. I have two cards, I think, with the move sigil. I don't know if I have any pelts, because I don't, I don't think I kept the pelts from the boss battle. I don't remember. Ugh, I don't remember if I kept the pelts from the boss battle. I don't remember if I had a ring. Shoot. Um. That's kind of up in the air. I don't remember seeing a ring. I'm gonna not pick that one. And of course I can't look. <laughs> um I wish I knew if I had kept the cards from Fight with the Trader. Oh well, I don't know. Yes! I wish you luck. Ooh, that was fortunate. An elk pawn is a card with the sprinter sigil. Yes. <laughs> uh, oh, close one. I'm gonna check and see if I have a ring actually in the next fight. The boon of the bone will work. Start a battle with eight bones. Boon of the forest, grand furs, boon of the ambidex ambidextrous. Definitely ambidextrous. Okay, I have to be on, on my game. Super thoughtful. You managed to get both of my boons. I rarely say this, but I am impressed. You have been a worthy adversary. But unfortunately, I must soon put you to death. Mm, we shall see. We'll see about that. You're back. I'm back. That's it. Like, this is not the same me, probably, from before. What do you mean? Oh, how I relish this moment. You suck. You absolutely suck. Two flames will not suffice this time. Suck. I hope you know that. I just want you to know, for I die, that you suck. <sighs> Talk about handicaps. Gosh. Any advice for me here, Stoke? <laughs> uh. 
Okay. He can't attack. I need to not get all three of my spaces attacked at once. <sighs> okay. So I need to lose this. Um. Don't attack, so he will move around. The freebie. I'm gonna wait to use this. Um, I mean, it shouldn't matter. Because I'll keep the bones, but who knows? You could steal my bones. You could do anything. I don't know. <sighs> so magpie's eye. Okay. I'm gonna be very thoughtful, so it's gonna be a little slow. Because I have to think a few moves ahead. So in my hand, I have the stove. I can break open the black gold and try and go for a quick win. And I think that may be worth doing. Oh, nice. I forgot about that. <laughs> I got the ambidextrous. I'm going to need that. I think I'm going to go for the black goat, though. Um... I need to think whether I want to draw a squirrel. I can do that. I can draw a squirrel and block one of those. Because I need it. I keep forgetting the black goat costs one. So I needed that anyway. Next best bet is probably trying to get another bear on the board. Um, another option. I don't have two, two, four, six, eight. The vulture. I had a second vulture, didn't I? crazy. I thought I did. No, maybe not. That was a temporary thing. Um, he has mantis gods. I need to kill. 
I can't have all of them attacking because that's what nine damage. So let's see. That one's I'm safe for now. That one's gonna take out those three spaces this turn. Then those are all open. This one is free. Those two are gonna move up. I need to block them. I need to preferably block all three. I can use a squirrel for one. But they're gonna I need to really take them out. Um so I need something I can actually play. I would say using my bone cards might be best. Um What did I have? I had two extra, two, four, six, eight, ten. I need to do damage as well. There's nothing I can do right now. Well, there's nothing I can do. Let's all stay a hard choose. Take it! Like, what am I supposed to do? Look. <laughs> I can't do anything. Ah, uh, okay. And he's gonna take a card of mine and use it against me. Um marvelous. Oh I need to block him for sure. that I can also I can play a cockroach as well to take them out I'll put the amoeba to attack the amalgam. Um, this one can go here. <laughs> this is wrong. Ugh, probably should stream this so I can get advice. Um, let's see. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 13, 8, and 2. That's 10, so I have 3. Plus, I can grab some more. Oh, I hope this works. So that wisely stop pressuring me. Um
I don't have anything to sacrifice. Um, I have bones. Um, and nothing costs zero. I can weaken one to zero. It's power. Okay. You won't be able to do any damage. Okay. Let's do this. So. We play the stink bug here. The amoeba here. Amoeba, stink bug. And let's do it now. Amoeba, take new fish, easy. Not yet. Think Can't play you. <sighs> I've heard about that. I'm gonna take my vultures all I can do. He's going to attack me immediately. Uh, I think I messed up. Because I forget. I even keep forgetting about their abilities. Darn it. Um. don't really help me. Also, I don't think I have a ring. I was looking. Can't play anything else unless... <sighs> Let me see. So I have to sacrifice amoeba. Doesn't help me. Fresh shoes. I don't know, I'm in a desperate spot. And I can't do anything with a nugget. Well, actually, I have fresh blood. It doesn't have to use that against me. This is what I got, fellas. Go fish. <sighs> he didn't attack first. Okay. It doesn't have any attack, so that's good. Let's take out the amalgam. I have one. One, four, you live. Think of there. Um, one to sacrifice. You will also survive. You will do one damage and then I can probably take it out from there to block it from doing any damage to me.
I'm gonna run out of cards. <laughs> oh man, this is really strong. Let's see. I'm gonna actually try and get these uploaded tonight. I have three total. At least two. Well, the other one's a buffer. Um, or whatever it's called, they do. The videos. It's gonna be a decently long video. But this nug this nugget's gonna be here for a while. Um Because one thing that I'm having trouble with in terms of planning, I'm not entirely clear on the order of attack. So I pick my cards and then my cards that are on the board, I think he goes first and then I go. I need to pay more attention to that. Um, I have the squirrel on the board that's going to be here. So I have one readily available sacrifice. Um, I don't want to put another squirrel because then it uses up too much of the board. Um, let's do... Let's have you ready. And I have to do this three times. <laughs> um, I'm gonna use this when I have the bear in my hand. Um, looking at ones here. Let's see, that's gonna attack. And it's gonna take out my mole. It's gonna have one health left, though. I'm gonna need something that can take it out. Can do two. It's but it moves to the right. Wait, it moves. It has it can't move to the right because it has, doesn't have anywhere to move. Um. My best bet is probably either Tia or we have one. I can't do anything just yet. Um, he gets taken out. It might do two damage. This guy can move up though. But I'm protected. Now, I don't think it does o overflow damage. It has to be able to actually hit me. <sighs> Which I'm gonna have to stop. for what you can, but know this, the rest will stay and fight for me. <sighs> okay. okay. Crunch time. Um, let's look at my hand. Let's look at the board. You are here for a minute. Since you don't attack, it's in my best interest to leave this alone. Eat the squirrel. You are the biggest threat. I can put anything, anything down and take you out. <sighs> okay. I may need at least two. I'm gonna need at least two sacrifices. I need one squirrel. Um. We're gonna play the squirrel here. And I have 
River Snapper. Let's do this. Her brain is not. Let me just some water. Ugh. Squirrel here. So I have two. Adder. I need the adder. It can take it out in one hit. I think it attacks first. Oh shoot, let me check. Um, this is actually very important for planning. Um, let's see. Um, hmm. So they do I or let she go first. No, she never goes first. Basic rule of the game. really important and I'm like I don't know why I'm not picked that up uh, stop doing all the things okay um okay I guess I'm gonna have to guess for sure. All right, well, because I forgot. I think if the cards are there, you don't. I think he went first last time. I know I'm putting a squirrel here. Um, let's use the adder because you know what even if he does he'll survive the story I'm sticking with it all right uh, okay river snapper will live so I know I'm playing the adder here Range larva is going to need time. Um, this was another option, I guess, to put here. But I'm trying to buy time. All right. Oh my god, I run out of cards. Good. Okay, I do attack first. Okay, he's going to turn them all into gold. Okay. Okay. He's going to turn them all into gold. I think this next turn. Look at the squirrel. Um... I'm not going to play anything good. Um, but I'll 
have something up my sleeve. <sighs> you come back to me. Were you as faltering as the cockroach? Die already! I have one open space. Ugh, eight one. Um. One open space. I can use. Put a squirrel there. Um. He's gonna have to start attacking these. I need to put something there. I can put a cockroach there. I've had four. I can put a cockroach there and sacrifice it. <sighs> Nothing will serve. We meet again. You do no damage. I'm just getting stomped. Um, can't see. Have um, just give myself options. Right? Two, four. Two, four, six, seven. Place a bear. Let's place a bear. Ah, I don't have a bear. <laughs> Wait. Um. Will you? How much help do you have? You have two. Hey, you have two. I don't have a bear. Okay. Um. Because I need this to be able to play the bear. So, let's just place a squirrel. What are you doing? All stale hard chew. Yeah, get that, please. Thank you. New fish, easy choose. You ass. Nugget. <laughs> ah, it's played automatically. All right. If I played a bear, that's random because I couldn't plan for that. He didn't have the angler mask on when I was picking these cards. He could take him, but he, you know, he does do one damage. Um, if I get put the bear there, he's gonna take the bear. I can't replace it with a squirrel. I could sacrifice it for a cockroach, but then I lose the cockroach, which is a pretty um strategic card. What I got? What am I working with? Maybe to play this bear. Um, it's gonna be harder now. The raven may be a better choice. can't do anything. Anything I put down takes. Can't put anything. He should just take that. Even though it does do one damage. Um,
It only has one health left. I can play the cockroach or I can play the squirrel. Now I have to get, um... <sighs> give myself options, I guess. This would have time to grow. So if I play a squirrel, the squirrel won't disappear. Um, that's the one problem with those cards. I could play the cockroach. I could play the cockroach and then I can play the larva. I'm just getting tired. <laughs> okay, we better not steal it. All right. keep it trade for what you can but know this the rest will stay and fight for me can I, can I trade for my mind back And of course, he flies over the thing. I think I go first. So I'll take him out, but he'll hit me once. But then I have a free road to him. So. Oh, he flies. I forgot. Oh, okay. You capably endured the onslaught of rare creatures, but the true challenge was forthcoming. What was, what was that? Shadowy figures appeared before you. In their eyes glimmered a recognition of kinship, but colored by guilt. Oh no, they were betraying you. I remember that one fondly. Minsky. Ah, oh, I made that, I made that powerful card. <laughs> I reshuffle my deck. Like, okay. He just flies over, but that's fine because he's gonna take him out. He doesn't have the health for it. Um, because uh, I can correct even there's a creature opposing it because he will attack it. Um, you can't move forward. You will move forward, and you will take out both of these nuggets. And you have six health. I can lay this corpse maggot and face that card with a bear. I can face it with a bear and then the two. Or I can lay squirrels to block. Either way, I need to get this turn done with. Oh, I attack first. Nice. What are you about to do? What are you about to do? I forgot to attack. Thank you, Mothman. You're like the best car ever. Thank you. <laughs> oh. This damned moon is traumatic, yes, but it provides no value to my board. I wonder. Oh no, you cheater. Now that is value. <laughs> Out of cards, I'm sorry. I will attempt to hasten your demise. The moon will be your mercy. What am I supposed to do about this? These nuggets are actually helping me. What does this even mean? At the beginning of his owner's turn, a car bandit will 
pull small creatures like squirrels into its orbit. Omnistrike, this sigil will strike each opposing space that is occupied by a creature. It will strike directly if no creature opposes it. it will block opposing creature bearing the airborne sigil. Okay. Wow, that was the a whole moon. You are a major cheater. I can't do anything. Um, my best bet. Don't hit it, Tom. <sighs> I don't have anything that negates the blocking of the flying. I just, I don't. And it does two damage. It'll take out Mothman. If it does, it'll take out everything, actually. Which will clear the board. Um, that's 40 health. It'll clear the board. I can lay down three squirrels. Because I need to stop it from attacking the lanes. At least more than one lane. <sighs> okay. I have four squirrels. Um well I know I need to let this I love how it's just like, oh look at the cards you don't have. Um I have no items, I have nothing. <laughs> this is to the wire. I need to let this turn pass. That needs to happen. needed to happen. It's gate. Why are you gaining power? Okay. I need to protect my lanes, basically. I don't know what it is. Pull small creatures into its orbit. Um, which is some bullcrap. So I can't use squirrels? What does that mean? Do they not stay? Let me try and play a squirrel. On its turn though. Of its owner's turn. So it will do it and leave that lane open? Is that what it's saying? I'm gonna play the bear. There's no other use for this card. Except being on a small creature. If it attacks me in two lanes, that's six. One, two, three, four. I won't survive. I can only risk, because I'm not sure how that works. Like, does it remove it? Let me see. Title lock is what it's called, right? Title lock. So, title lock is a sigil unique to the moon, a card in Act 1. At the beginning of the owner's turn, the sigil causes squirrels and rabbits on the player's side of the field to be removed from play. Um, yeah, the point is to drop the record to block, prevent you from blocking direct attacks. Um, okay, so yeah, um. So it does exactly what I thought it did.
Okay. So it does exactly what I thought it did. So I need to block every other lane with creatures. Okay. Uh, okay. With creatures that likely won't survive. As it does three damage. You will survive. survive the block or do one attack um you will come back to me and I have no other bone cards does actually block it uh and it doesn't do damage after so it takes that turn to take the car okay okay that's good to know i get six more damage and it'll have 20 um can i summon losing any of my cards um this is a bat war of attrition at this point um fine how many do I have I uh, okay, have a few two four Four, six, eight. Return to my hand. I use the squirrel, so I shouldn't waste it. I should do something that does damage. Enough damage. Um, unfortunately. survive. Nothing else can survive the onslaught. Uh. I actually need more cockroaches because <laughs> then I can keep killing the squirrels and the cockroaches will keep coming back and I'll keep replenishing the bones. It does more damage every time. How? What ability is that? Is it gaining power from the squirrels? Oh, help me. Oh, for all that is good in this world. Really? I think it's gaining power from the squirrels. It's got the nerve to gain power from the squirrels. Okay. Fine. Fiduciary. <sighs> I don't have any more cards. Unbelievable. I don't know if it's just gaining power or if it's gaining power from the squirrels is sucking up. When it dies, it immediately goes back into my hand, right? I don't have enough power to end it. I just don't.
wait. Oh, I have these, but that doesn't really help me. It wouldn't help me anyway. I might as well use it. It doesn't help me. <sighs> I'm so close. So far away. You need to do anything. Stop. Draw a card. I can't! I don't have anything! I do have a ring. Oh, okay. I could have did that one, but this was whatever. not going to have enough to beat it in this war of attrition. I don't have anything else. I can't draw a card. Aho, you know this. I'm so close. I was about to beat the moon with a cockroach, man. I can't draw one. Oh, God. Can't get an eyeball, can't do anything. <sighs> I have no options. So close. Made it so far. Darn it. Darn it. Please try to remain live for just a short while longer. Oh, like a memento. Your death card. Let us begin. Please choose a card to draw the cost from. Cost of free from the game. And another, this time I'll use its power and health, the number. Three power and two health removed. Now choose a card from which you'll extract the sigils. Sigil Sprinter and Fledgling. Never did actually your name and loop. <laughs> Uh, I don't know. That's what beat the crap out of me. Ah, he didn't lose his camera. Last challenger made it all the way to the end of the path. They were not prepared for what awaited them there. What are you looking at? Keep your eyes on me. Foul, stunted wolf. You really want such a creature in your deck? The sight of it does try my temper, but it has been dealt, so it stands. Looks different now, too. this okay. no there's still only one mm, that's interesting. oh these mushrooms are new they help me I just only one hmm Feed him once more, that should do it. Ugh. What am I doing to have up this speed? Okay, this is doable. Squirrel Wolf. Let's see what that does. Alright. These were not here before. Alright. Okay, so I'm gonna end this here. I'm gonna try and uh, it's getting late. I'm gonna try and beat him one more time. Um, I'm gonna end this episode and we will move into the next one. I'll try and go really quickly. We'll see.
So, bye-bye. See you in a minute.